Hi, I'm Ryan Fleming, a physical therapist at Atlantic Physical Therapy in Laurel, Delaware. Uh, my tip of the day today includes talking about plantar fasciitis, which is pain on the bottom of the foot. It's a very common problem that most of us tend to get. Um, something you might be able to do, actually three things you might be able to do before you see your doctor is potentially, uh, one, check your shoes. If you have old beat up shoes that don't have any more support and the laces are broken, that could be a good reason why you're having plantar aspect uh, foot pain. So check your shoes, make sure um, if they're worn out, go ahead and get a new pair that's pr uh, preferably a lace up shoe, okay? The second thing you can do, which is pretty easy, is take a water bottle, pour about one ounce of water out of the bottle, put the cap back on tightly and put it in your freezer. Freeze the water bottle so it's ice. You're gonna take that ice water bottle and you're gonna roll it on the bottom of your foot for three to five minutes. Okay, that's gonna provide kind of a light massage to the bottom of the foot. It's also gonna provide the ice that it needs to calm down the inflammation. Okay, thirdly, one thing you can do is do a calf stretch. Okay, another problem with plantar fasciitis is people tend to have tight calves. I'm gonna show you one way to do it at the wall. You basically can do just a standard stretch, push against the wall lightly, put the foot that's painful in the back, and you're gonna keep your heel down and lean forward. You're gonna hold this for about 15 seconds, okay? And then you can repeat that five times. So these are three basic things that you can do if you have plantar fascia pain without potentially having to get into a doctor. If you still continue to have an issue, physical therapy does a pretty effective job in treating it. Thanks for watching.